Hi, I'm Michael Ruby. Welcome to the Station Hill Intermedia Lab, where our goal is to create long form works that bring together words, music, and video, and sometimes more. My co-curator is Sam Truitt. We couldn't do this without David Shell, our host here at Green Kill Gallery, a peer-to-peer -peer artist space in Kingston, New York, and the magician behind these sessions. David Strahl is on sound. Also, we'd like to give out a shout out to Cinema Animal, the underground film collective screening this session at a theater in the city of Guanajuato in Mexico. Tonight's performance, Landfall, is the enactment of a there and back poem chronicling a 2013 oceanic excursion from Manhattan to Christiansted in the Virgin Islands and points between, composed by Sam Truitt, now joined by Stephen Lewis and Mike Raddy's improvisational music, coupled with the whale song recordings of David Rothenberg, and all as seen through Richard Crowling's cinematic interpretation. We're going to see tonight in a big ship with a powerful engine. Ships used to carry us and our things great distances. Ships carried many of our ancestors here. Ships still carry our things as we read in the news about shipping bottlenecks, supply chain problems. Landfall, among other things, captures the immense force of big ships carrying us and our things. The poet captures it on a cruise ship, which has the added attraction of being a symbol of excess, always calling out for its iceberg. Let's begin. I had not known life had made so many masks as people form their paths. I had not known life had made so many paths as people form their masks. I had not known life had made so many masks as people form their paths and they're each on show two or three columns to the side of this stage this threshold inhabits including our moans waiting to board through narrow manned gangway portal the never dead, never dead center, or a tick off, off, so I keep moving, moving, 
relative to the suck, aka vacuum, aka rhythm. We sense yawn at the heart of what we may get. May get to the other side of what we know is a rubber room to know a whorl of, whorl of, like Ishmael. If we are steady with Bushido, blade, plumb, level to the eye, down the center of our axes to where the wobble wends through the rubble to be truly and completely and wholly amid things under the sun ray to know we get this brief glimpse to fix an outside when of course there isn't any. Yet to pretend a while, pretend a while everything isn't perfect under sun. Sun, our soul representative image of what's beyond light and waits and watches the lovely gambles the lovely gambles of fools on a ship thereof as last as last light leaves the harbor with us following the Hudson Canyon out the New York fight by way of Ambrose Horn into the darkness like an animal wrong, an animal wrong fighting back, moans, moans, groans, bones, our own, that come to one disappearing. But I have to write, right there's a reef off the starboard side of the ship in which I sit, I sit to write an undersea ledge, a white line of surf right across the water. Like a poetry one and the sun now, now an orange inch, inch across the horizon, the miracle glows, it grows, it groans. And how cool over rhyme, green, sea, rhyme, green, sea, beyond land, smudges and open sky, sun, open, converging with the curve of earth going right on into it. It like so many, so many before, and I guess I don't care about the backfield or anything else past this to hear the bell of a green buoy clang like a Japanese shrine like a Japanese shrine in the middle of what shortly shortly will become open ocean Or I see the last channel marker ahead. Ahead, time to roll another cigarette. And this amazing experience, what is ever, what is ever would wish you were here, here for, or everyone was, was and could all of us alive a moment through my eyes grasp revelation of last of last land 
none of this can be put inside a diamond because it is one or none would fit this so beats air like the fabled bird of the soul so beats air like the fabled bird of soul softening care to make of this a living adventure a living adventure I cannot explain the push right through the tube the tip of as both science and art prove because they deal with facts not maps maps as the new moon departs to port the star white haired snakes on the south southeast path an archipelago of clouds bright with dawn light lights before they break off her eye too and it's azul 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 all the way to the screw the screw i imagine I imagine how else can we know? We know counterclockwise, God, the concept turns the end of imagination toward. In both senses, sea and on, and sky and on, and on, and on to prowl, to prowl the invariousness of it all. It all which with Gerda I doubt, as in beauty lies difference and pattern, which might be repeated, but is in its breaking releasing, releasing to get your scale inside, inside the slightest, slightest face to face or touch or sound or sigh is the keening, the keening, the heart of every energy, elegy system alive, cries to form, moderately larger swells that seem to nose south, southeast, the from the tenth deck appear about three feet, three feet or a meter, a meter or a trillion feet, Leading out or balancing, sea move out, ocean is lovely, as though hiding something. Snapping off boat calls, slapping of weight and prow, which is diamond its faces, of course, thick, around us a poem. Around us a poem as soft as we discover. Interiority. If we let go, trying to face it, trying to face it, trying to face it, describe of what face can writing be, but tossed into one of the slots in the casino called Da Vinci's Mystery. Da Vinci's mystery that manages a pile of coin and paper money being pushed off a moral cliff by applying more money egged on by more money the image that's behind money behind money which must elbow Grisham's good and bad money Chasing each other like one black and one white snake around the trees of life take root in the shape of as their app tumbling through metal sheets. Music seeps from evoking his hot breath still on our necks, made of syllogisms. The doors and stairs, they are all the same.
all the same, they're side to side. In reverse, port to starboard. And it's only letters and numbers in the end. The end to guide you through it like the cabinet of Dr. Caligari. But then music coming from all the slots and the whole place hums with paralytic power balls parting souls from their being alone in the secrets of southern mirth allowing everyone to come to nurse to nurse the curse wherein malfunction voids all pains voids all pains and plays as the folk suddenly sways on its beam axis more radical coiling the dragon around us. Including the cards we use to access X, including money that somewhere like conference attendees, albatrosses around their necks. And I want to play cards or may or just cooling my jets at the bar where I can smoke and drink and think about playing blackjack like a captain of the alleged world Leonardo knew knew and anticipates as I step in or soon as then I'd have to lose this pen that says Mon Lunas on it, shed uniform behind the facade. All this drops off, gave me a stride, the invisible, invisible, silent, silent gasp, gasp calling me fathom. Fathom, ocean. That at night there is a certain sovereign light darkness can touch but cannot sign. One can see now into the water of, and it's almost time to get in, in and under and through, through blue waves to find myself deep, deep inside the arrange. An hour on watching the fields of ocean roll on. I wake up and look out some hundred yards and then lower eye. I the goal down to which to play with numbers, which is repetition, repetition yet each set, each set self-identical, and so there is none, none to rhyme in, in space-time. But let's pretend a while and gaze at the one horizon we will ever know. Or walk out this one, counting down sun flames in a path clear west to Savannah, looking right out of me as the massive water buffalo shoulders through horizon haze to lock horns with a dog reared up on hind legs, snapping us at a ball, at a ball, as best as I, as best as I can, puzzle, puzzle, out. Now, 
pass back, pass back directly to the arms of the rain hung sun itself that is beyond description and is the other side from which nothing hides. Horizon is as far away, away as far around, around the world as I have come, come in a circle, a circle open, open to once. As the side of the face catches fire, the starboard side, to have one step down, so I may dissolve a threshold, dissolve a threshold and clamor onto its back and get some some perspective as a meteor might, might and for brief fiery second, fiery second taste between earth and sky, between earth and sky, her eyes on mine, through sliding door, rolling off her couch, her couch bed catching my eye, letting me see her eyes, eyes and body, body and the boat thumping through waves, unceasing vibration, signaling to eternity and ocean, time comes draped in waves, unceasing vibration, signaling an eternity, an ocean time comes draped in, always that close to getting in naked, unfaking, non-separate, non-separate breath where even surrender is, is a mask for what cannot last, last another word. Which nothing is possible without or within arterial walls, blue calling on and on. on repeating dance fragments, sweat soaks. Soaks into a pillow. Like emerald moss on flame. The ocean dances, finding somehow that searching in is the finding out, out over and over, so that it keeps on back and forth to spin the mirror. We keep breaking, breaking, calling, calling to each other to gather now where it can't be lost beyond the crater dancing finds antecedent the search lies buried in alive which can only happen moment in moment past wave tops sway joining forever terms my glands out ahead hand the body lives by way of, and mouth, mouth and what it does not eat, not eat to carve to help, to help by skimming the senses with the fires of psyche, the fires of psyche dreaming ahead a body, a body to remove its cloak in the Atlantic. Only a snitch of which we know. Or trembling feel through my tones via the boat's spine, bouncing off swells as the principle of the sea rolls on and on, always off. A 27 foot displacement, some hundred feet above the sky. The sky has 
at first, gazing stone-faced into the sun path and surrounds us on a fine, intelligible morning deck dance and observation of the human form. The human form on this boat out trembling on this view into the abyss as good as another one we are always on. Always on the deck of peering out into unbridgeable and inconsolable gap under radar dish. Who are we signaling to? Horizon that is round is round and we are are cut off off its prism we are approaching landfall always the point at which we will close on life but it never will as it is open Yet with my red hand, I want to press to the cave wall to get to where it is a different it. Even if the left does not know what the right touches here. And here we are. Hard for that moment to wash salt out of our hair. Freedom is most brisk at the periphery of any society until it consumes itself in geometries it can no longer control and implodes into itself a boundary it cannot cross. Freedom is most brisk at the periphery of any society until it consumes itself in geometries it can no longer control and implodes into itself a boundary it cannot cross. A hand. A hand. My hand. Hand face. Face in. This. A book. This. A book and. And my hand. Face in ocean. In ocean shine. Together with the mind reach of a thousand suns, each wave an eternity wording each place, and through the primordial head of a turtle, pokes laughing the love of non yertlin geometries. As I am beginning to savage how to surrender to myself within, or measure, weight, no substance, neither to breathe, nor beat, nor feel the face of the sun stream a moment in its way, past three or four planets, back taking time to excise some lost rhyme, rhyme like Solomon just out of reach of sign, of sign fixed on the wall of the exhibition to which no dates affixed only materials of composition, of composition, no direction known, a completed unknown, the memory of that tree, the memory of that tree. The memory of that tree I took a picture of, having left the house as a child, to walk north toward what wasn't there, with a camera hung from a line against my chest, against my chest, reading, fool, and laying down on the winter ground at its base, 
pointing into its branches. Snap off the image. The image I am still lost in the intervals of As in species memory, we have no home. Have no home, and holy shit, as Earth rears up as an island in the stream called Sua Luaiga. Idol, as though there were no sky to get in the way of the sunshine or the interval in love with the in and out and out and paradigms of mind and constant question. Yet that water is blue and there are children in them, waves against shores of endless light swimming on astro blast sculpting the universe as it is described, wave on wave, mounting more than what's there. More than what's there, mounting wave on wave, describes the universe as it is, that sculpts astro blast, swimming on endless light against shores, of a place where sound is ground to bits of double dragon speech before sense can let go and watch it fly into black night, the waves speak. The waves speak to as the ancients knew, the ancients knew to speak to the waves to call its shadow stars echo the first words it drew and dropped in the well of unknowing itself. The well of unknowing itself. Busy trying to dance off the headdress of death. But it doesn't wear any staring straight at me. Just as in every human photograph, death's the central figure staring out. Staring out, and there is no out. More than in life, the movement, another frame. Fate behind all my buffers and walls, a huge reservoir of sadness ready to cash out. Isn't that the Thunderbird where there is no direction? There is no direction beyond in the first word where the sun takes shelter. The pattern of each of these true views of what is is found lying on a plank seat. on a plank seat set adroitly into the base of a sea grape tree and climb such that you may plunge eye into its canopy of limbs and leaves and shades and sun swaths arranged above and around you around you gold threads in what heaven you may bring bring to the magic of finding love love amidst the living you are brain of brain of behind and before each moment you breathe breathe into it both and not let go the sway whisper yes through its teeth even where there is no storm to ace as each is once Ah. 
where the sun takes shelter. Shelter the pattern of each of these true views of what is, is found. And there is no regretting again these faint human spasms radiating in every direction. We don't take to take because we are their image. Snapping with intelligence the wind that bends them. So and so and so we go and go craning on, craning on for some zero, zero view. But why not let it go? But why not let it go? Why not let it go to unweave at a point at which when, where we snatched is what let in the God. Because this tree, the world calls to tender me, who is nothing I can see through. Where the sun and peaks above a cloud sheet that it cannot meet, even as a jet lays down a con trail like a line of cocaine across a mirror, I am bending over, over and with elbows out. Bang, the arc of the orange sun appears through a slit and I can look straight into its mountain mouth as tongues of light fan over a distant ocean patch with just its lip visible now. Yet above the ledges of clouds, bright white against dark, shaggy bulks, form two triangles we disguise with our lives, space, through our lives, time. And what, when we dream, frames are blown from, thrown open onto an empty street. Street I can walk only, I can only then walk onto, down, or up. So what if the street is the whale's road and I am on a boat in a chair on a porch looking out over a rail and below an inch below the horizon which is this line a single sail is seen on or east bearing more or less south so opposite us following the Gulf Stream north with the swift reach back and back in fact, we each to our separate lives, and I can tell you everything about them, because I am one of them, and they are one of me, and we all live in an X-machine, driving through eight-foot swells that rock the boat, up and down and back, up and down and back, or why does why back keep coming back back except we are going there turning that last moment touching the sun echoing on as though one let go the balloon and still watching it like a child to hold in time a plane to 
no vibration or the sail east on the horizon. This line stakes and follows always between the really forming a triangle, the square of which is one on all planes infinite. And some clouds fast now, so no sunset to record, only dawn and days ahead through all the layers of fate that sometimes are hard to trace. Even with markers, even with markers and some time piecing the world together like a lullaby. And I look up and the sail is gone. And I feel the textual error like tiger tracks through a pillow or a couple embracing. I see them kissing her left arm around his back and she is looking up into his eyes and through the back of his head into the rest of their lives together clasping and unclasping before sea and sky and sky or Dante in DC. The day we allow true love to appear, those things that are well made will fall into confusion and will overturn everything we believe to be right and true. And first of all ourselves, for lack of love of a better word form, we invented time to crown or death or whatever came first. The wind blows through off rising seas, up, up, pink blush on the cheek of the horizon in one spot where it will rise a silver light, then an arc, then a slice, and it's happening as fast as I can write. A full third now. I now know how fast our earth and sky align. And now really the mouth of a tunnel with a lintel of clouds, of clouds so that we have to climb, climb under them to step off, off the sea see to get a leg, a leg in before poof, poof, the sun is whole and gold with rays, with rays in all directions spreading. I can no longer look into it as all around to find it, as wave tops catch and the sky bright, facts resonant earth forward along its claws, a blight's tree, in the branches of which we sing, in the branches of which we sing, scattering holy words, incandescent, with both consuming myself and all my others with them. And how the path has opened the sun an inch above the horizon, the first steps of which are moderate five foot swells that if I could look into it without inner blanching fear of blindness would open to find a tongue of pure gold or spine or rainbow or laughter pattern soul surrender surrender I have just formed formed in my heart my heart echoing aspiration beyond words for lack of a better one love to find waves around us in every direction a sign of we are not long on this planet of and did what gold ocean new arrangements 
of sights and sets and animal alphabet figures swallowing our foreheads as ways the spirit may spread spread its wake wake we're alive alive arrives on airborne golden golden chariots of jive bathed in red light like a cannibal eye I waving our bodies lie unburied back back into the world waving deep transatlantic loose and blue blue with surface veins of plankton plankton so the ocean failed in aspects like a pollock if we could hold it still enough to read more than its passing as though he were the sea god of trails to connect to make a carpet which at any moment he may pull away to find it's clouded over with some sun swaths opening in intervals across a principally calm oceanic plain with dominant sense being the engine and scud sound of wave breaking on the hull. The hull my ears seem a form of, as though it were my head, my head falling on and breaking back, back white water to ply our way ahead, where the real adventure lies thoughts the open sky the open sky surrounds sounds of melody to which there is no rhyme because it is all of them where we are even if we are not on the horizon or the horizon more the horizon leaps and east, the ocean tilting to reach with weight that light Lucretius hooks where behind the sun shines birth to what we know of giving, which is a hair of a strand of weeds floating on the Sargasso Sea as we are, and it is not quite all what I imagined. treasure is that within us that can contain an ocean on which to mull a filament of this orbiting ball. We are in perfect equanimity of our simple fitting on in air this water and fire in the belly, skies most intimately tether, tender, space because we never did let go the blue balloon and born ahead plow through eight plus foot rolls in off the beam under lowering sky and felt that all our cells are on call to the staggeringness of the scale undimmed by circular blindness each moment a soul rhyme a gleam to reach our hands around the fruit even if it is that past awareness on a cliff above the sea monstrosity window window in on and on infinity a hymn to the trembling world. We are so briefly a matter of floating. Even as limbs plant love with each element. Even as limbs plant love with each element. The teeth of the city 
taking shape through blue sheets of fog. The teeth of the city taking shape through blue sheets of fog. Her bells, crystal eddies, broken speakers, spears making at the frame's edge. What we need is nothing to briefly sing the many-faced pirouette on the seawall and facing on the seawall and facing how simple simple it it all is all who try to hold the wind that is only another form devoided to the faces devoided to the faces of the gods of the gods with whom with whom we hold this planet nowhere <laughs> 